even though I am an attorney, it does not mean that I think our justice system is always very just. There was a woman who obtained a restraining order and she had that in family court. We were representing her her case was very strong and unlike in many cases, she actually had evidence, you know, to show abuse. But somehow, you know, this restraining order happened in, in district court. The dad went into family court and filled out an affidavit filled of lies. Now, if you're if you've been to court before, a lot of times what will happen is if somebody is asking for something on an emergency basis, what the judge will often say is, okay, well, I understand this is an emergency. We're gonna put it down for a quick return date, but we want the other side here to be able to tell me what's going on on their side. So the dad had filled out, you know, an affidavit filled with things that I know were completely opposite of the evidence that we had and basically went in and got an emergency order. So without mom coming in with this judge, knowing there was a restraining order, got an emergency order for sole legal and physical custody and had the kids taken away from mom while she had a restraining order that included them until they were able to get back into probate and family court. And then that all changed because we were able to show that. Um, but it was, it was a situation that literally blew my mind because a lot of times to be on the other side and we've been on the other side where it's the mom or the person who's received the restraining order, we know that there's lies on that side. So we've been on the other side and we've never been able to get into court. So it, it just blew my mind, especially with the fact that everything was lies. So, um, and during all of this, there was a DCF investigation going on that came out and said that dad was neglectful of the kids and it was against dad. So again, you know, this is where it gets really frustrating because people can just go to court and just lie. So yeah, that's my uh, love the court system story of the day.